Welcome to Jessup Lead. My name is Fritz Moga, and I serve as the lead faculty for the youth ministry degree. I love to snorkel. I remember the first time I went to Hawaii and I put the mask and the snorkel on, but in my head I'm thinking, I won't see much in the water. And I dove in and a world of life was there. Fish everywhere, it was pretty amazing. A while later, I went to the poorly named Clear Lake, which is in Northern California. I dove in expecting that same thing, but I didn't see anything. That lake is anything but clear. There's nothing like snorkeling. It can be amazing, but there's nothing more disappointing than a murky, unclear lake. Today, let's talk about transparency. The definition of transparent is capable of being seen through or the ability of light to pass through. In our case, for leadership, it's being clear about one's intentions. It's about being open and honest in all that we do. And we can see this importance through Scripture. 1 John 1 5 says, This is the message we've heard from Jesus and now declare to you. God is light and in him there is no darkness at all. There's no murkiness with our Jesus. And Isaiah 2, 5 then encourages us as it says, Come, descendants of Jacob, let us walk in the light of the Lord. So how do we let the light of Jesus pass through us? How do we then walk in the light in a way that brings clarity? How can we become more see-through or more transparent in all areas of our life? Simply admit. Admit to yourself and then maybe someone else when you recognize you're not being completely open. You're not being completely honest, either in your personal life or your ministry life. And once you admit it, then begin to act accordingly. So you may have guessed where I'm sitting right now. This is beautiful Lake Tahoe. One of the things this lake is known for is its transparency. Historically, you can see 80 to 100 feet below the surface, which makes snorkeling here unbelievable. Will you or the ministry you are serving see you as murky, unclear, or maybe even hypocritical in your life? Or will others see you as transparent? Will they see with clarity your intentions and your motivations. A writer, Trent Shelton, says this, your transparency will lead to other people's transformation. And isn't that what we're all about? God, thank you that we have just a moment to sit, to look, and to think about transparency. May our lives be see-through. May your light shine through us in such a way that our intentions are clear to others. Help us to do this in your power, in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you.